So two years at Alabama, but a lottery pitch all the way. Chiefin misses there on the long two. Butler to the basket, gets it to go. So it's been a great offensive display for the goal thus far. And you would think with those numbers, they would have a much bigger lead considering the squadron only shooting 33% from the floor. But the squadron have done okay from three, too. They've got uh, about 46% from the floor with the three ball. Butler launches up a three, and he gets it to fall. Point of having a coach that's had college success to be able to come here and learn a completely different game. But to be able to relate to the college players coming in. And Dylan Martin, that's his second three of the game. He's got six points. Eight point ball game. Coach Hewitt, so classy in winning as well. Credited the Windy City Bulls when I spoke to him in the post game. There's Butler with the drive. And that one falls too. Jared Butler. I can also be petty too, depending on my situation. <laughs> As Petty misses there. I don't let my wife hear that. See, that's my nickname, King Petty. Oh, beautiful play there, Golden again. No weapon to perfection hundreds of years after Dr. James Mason. Martin in and out. Another three ball on the way. But the knock on his game was that he was a great shooter, so he improved on that. And he had absolutely zero weaknesses, more deficiencies in his game. Because when he supposedly could Sebrin on the drive there. Ten point game. Squadron is hanging around. Duval. Butler. Butler probing. Pushes that one up and in. And now, we, sorry, partner, we got a nine point game. And another turnover leading the points off of turnovers for the squadron. That is the one advantage they've had throughout this game. Camper goes in, kicks it. Three ball on the way, fires and 